My name is Pascal Bouquet. I'm the Global Head of Architecture for Drug Development in Novartis. Novartis is uh, one of the first global healthcare company in the world. We distribute product to 155 countries and we reach 800 million patients. The initial driver to be pretty transparent was to gain more agility in the IT system. So it was very IT driven and that was to open the data we have, creating data services and creating some more loose coupling between applications so that we can phase in, phase out more easily technology and applications. That was when we started. Now we have a huge digital disruption. We have a huge digital disruption in healthcare. Uh, the healthcare system will be drastically different in 10 years from now. And we see really API microservices along with containerization as a foundation for this digital transformation. I think the very first challenge was to create the right API strategy and the API, API governance. So that's basically what we started with really to define how we are going to co govern APIs. I think the API is really a change of culture, especially for architects, and it's really foster the collaboration because basically you have to open your world, no more working in silo, but basically opening your APIs and making sure you have consumers for the API. So the main challenge, I would say, might not be the technology challenge. Um, that's probably more how do you change the culture in IT, and as well in business, because very soon we are going to go to data services, to API economy. You can imagine algorithm being exposed as APIs. We created an API program. API is basically one of the six uh, technology enablers in our IT strategy. We have a strategy and governance implemented. We have implemented a platform, the API Amplif platform. And uh, we have onboarded already 300 APIs, which can be data services or business services. That's where we are in a year, which is quite uh, amazing for me. We started with a basic API implementation architecture with a gateway we have in Europe and US. We see more and more the needs to extend this architecture with having more gateway in China, in Japan, to respect data residency requirements we have in those countries. And basically we have a plan to onboard many more APIs from various programs. So we mandate each and every program to use API today. I think part of the next step is as well how we use microservices and how we use the platform basically to onboard microservices as microservices is going to be a key architecture principles for future platforms, future development.